At that moment, I found respect for the sport. And at that instant, I was thrown back into reality in a heartbeat. Hello, welcome back. And in today's video, we will discuss our past weekend's practice session at Mukhatle. It was exciting. I enjoyed it a lot, ups and the downs. And we will also discuss the following two months, um, what's going to happen in the journey of um, to the roof of Africa. Um, so exciting stuff. But first, let's start with Mukhatli. What a way to start this adventure, eh, guys? Look at that awesome view. This is Africa. So we started with a bit of a downhill section, a rocky downhill section. It's always been my favorite. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I've, uh, I've really, hate, not hated, but it's one of the toughest things for me. It's going downhill. And, uh, but I'm getting better at it and uh, slowly but surely getting more confident. So, uh, so you can see me going going down, going down, slowly, we're almost there and uh, up to here I think we made it and uh, we, we, we can go. So here uh, one of the guys front brake disc protection cover fell off and they're busy repairing that. Just see what I'm doing there. Did you see what I did there? Um, just keep that in mind. We're going to talk about that right now. Okay, so busy fixing it. I think they fixed it and uh, it's ready to go again. You can see uh, a bit of a rut. These guys just fly through it. You can see what the experience does in confidence. So at this point, I remembered uh, I closed the valve on the tank. And it took me a minute and a half just to get back up and running again. I was really frustrated about what I did there. It was not necessary and it, uh, it took me two minutes, one and a half, two minutes just to get back in action. Limpy is giving a bit of a show there. So this was uh, sort of the first section that we did. It was these small um, riverbeds, really narrow uh, riverbeds. It's really nice to, to ride and you can see how I'm ducking and swerving just to miss the thickets and the branches. Um, uh, this was very nice, I enjoyed that. So yeah, Rimpi told us we're going to do a bit of a drag race, so let's see what happens. Yep, dead last. But it was fun, it's fun. It's, it's fun to, to have a team like this. So we started here and then the second section or third section was a bit of a wider riverbed, uh, looser sand than rocky sections. Um, I haven't ridden, uh, I haven't, uh, haven't practiced or ridden in this sandy section before so it was weird to, to ride here. You can see how much water there is bit of a splash there but I did I enjoyed it it was fun um, it's more technical than you think just to to get through the sand you can see I'm struggling there just to get through um, another splash there guys in front giving their all this was also a very nice uh, nice experience And now we're on to our next section. I thought this was a nice, nice shot uh, of the power lines above me going all out. It was nice. So here you can see there's a bit of a. Um, it's not a valley. It's more of a, a small hill that I need to climb. All of the guys are over there are on the top, and I need to get there. 
Uh, I've dropped my bike a bit there, just getting it in place again, getting it started. Just getting that first bit of momentum is, is, is essential. I'm still not all the way there, but I'm, I'm, I'm getting there. I'm also, if you can, you will see, you also hear, yeah, I'm trying, I'm spinning the wheels and spinning the wheels, but there is a point where I'm, where I'm starting to, to manage my grip using the clutch and the throttle, and with that, I'm, I'm successful. So, there's still a lot of, lot to learn and to memorize and to, to get ready, but I'm getting there. I'm definitely getting there. Alright, here's another section. It's about halfway in the middle. You can see just how quickly you can get in trouble um, because of the standing water. You can't see where you're driving. I hit a rat. This is also a very nice, a bit more technical, um, rocky sections, and um, I enjoyed it. I really enjoyed this day. Um, bit more bigger, bolder, rocky sections. A bit more technical. Um, bit struggling a bit more, but I'm getting there. I'm over. Yeah, here we go. So this section I rode, I was there at this point. I was on my own, <coughs> and I followed the tracks. And one of the teammates, teammates, one of my teammates just went through here. And I was like, nope, there was too much branches in the way and thickets, so I first had to get all of that out of the way, and from there, I needed to get myself out. Um, my rear wheel was stuck, so you can see me struggling to get uh, grip, getting out of here, starting to build momentum, going back and forth, back and forth, um, up to a point. I got over like that. It's just keep on, keep on going. So at that, at this point, I was alone, so I wasn't sure where to go. I lost the tracks, so I just wanted to get my my heading ready again, or get myself in the correct heading. So from here, I just remember, just keep following the bed, uh, the river bed. You catch up. Alright, so there's my first little fall I had. Not too big, not too not too bad. I got up and uh, I'm ready for ready to continue. So I'm back with the gang. This is more at the end of the day. Um, on our way back, a bit of a bit more of uh, riverbed riding, and to see just on our way back enjoying the ride. Um, you can see a bit of splashing, and uh, this is also nice. This this one part where the splash just went like boom. You can see it. You'll see it now. It was, it was awesome. This section, um, the rocks were extremely slippery, um, and you couldn't get any grip. I didn't get any grip. It took me half an hour just to get through this section. Um, by the time I, I got 15 meters, the other guys came back and said, no, "This is too slippery. Let's get off, uh, get off here, and uh, let's skip this section." So. It was very, very slippery here. Yeah. Another small fall, not too bad. Trying to pick my bike up again. Not bad. Got up. Alright, another rocky section. You can see the guys in front of me. How they're struggling, or not struggling, but how the bike is moving, and um, you can give get a bit more of a perspective of the obstacles, how big the obstacles actually are. 
But like I said, this this type of terrain, I like it. It's really cool. And um, one of the things that I've enjoyed so much about this one is the scenery, the nature. It's really beautiful there. Um, I would love to, to, to go there again and uh, do this all over again. Oh! Okay, it's a bit hard to fall there. Eh? Man. Okay, I'm looking if everything is okay. Am I okay? Yes, I'm okay. I can stand up. Okay, let's continue. Alright, I managed to again get back to the team where they're waiting for me. I'm quite a bit slower than the rest of the guys. I guess the fall. <laughs> the blue skies, it's awesome. Luckily here yeah, I wasn't last person because if this happened and someone wasn't oh! Okay, so there was my big fall. Man I think I, I've never fell so hard in my life. Luckily like I said I wasn't the last person other two teammates got up and got there soon enough checked my injuries and uh, to see if I'm okay um, it took me about 10 to 20 minutes just to get um, okay again because I was like I wasn't I wasn't okay here which was rough I'm very glad that I didn't break anything or got any other serious injuries. Um, so I just injured my elbow here and my on my stomach I got a, a rash and then my finger. So yes, that was my first big warning. I have been warned and uh, lessons learned. So I hope you enjoyed this. Um, just in terms of the next two months, there's about yeah, there's two months left, two months left before the MP, and um, I'm very excited about that. Um, so hopefully in two or three weeks I'll be back up again. I'll be able to uh, to practice again. Um, but in that three weeks, as you can see with that type of fall. I would I need to repair my motorcycle so my plan is to fix the motorcycle and give it a, a proper proper service to get it ready for the next practice section um, so stay tuned there's a lot of content content on the way um, you're gonna enjoy it and uh, if you enjoyed this video please like it please comment please share or subscribe to this channel um, like I said, a lot of videos still to come. Alright, bye.